hi guys welcome back to my channel hope you are all well so today's video is going to be slightly different and i'm going to be going through my nighttime skincare routine the products i'm going to be using are going to help with getting rid of my dark under eyes reducing my pores getting rid of spots and helping my dry lips so guys keep watching hope you enjoy and also don't forget to press subscribe and give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed this the first thing i do is cleanse my face i use three different products but this is the one i use probably the most and it is the mario acne facial cleanser i've had this for a while now i bought it because it's meant to help with like getting rid of spots and stuff like that and help with um oily skin and stuff but i tell you now this stuff actually does work like i can get a lot of quite um like white heads in like my kind of t-zone area and if i use this am and pm for a few days they'll literally be gone it is like the best thing to help get rid of spots so this is the acne facial cleanser by mary badescu i think that's how you say it badescu um they do some great products for anyone who has any problems with like spots anything like that so how i use it is brush a bit of warm water on my face and then put a little bit of this in my hand and run a bit of the warm water over that and then mix it into my skin wash it off with some warm water and then rinse it one more last time for, with cold water so just to let you know other products that i do use for cleansing are that are more than affordable um i get the clean and clear deep action cream wash which is oil free and this is nominated one of the uk's clear skin brand it cleans deep down to help prevent spots from first use so I, again i've used this for a long time as well this is a great one i'll use a bit more of a if i don't necessarily have spots but just help prevent it, i'll use this one it's more of a daily one if i want to use a scrub as a cleanser for the day i will use the visibility clear spot stress control from neutrogena and this helps clear spots before they appear um and it's more of a i don't know how to explain it you can, you can see here it's got like little bits in it so it helps exfoliate and that again also helps with spots so this is more than affordable the first product i will use after that is garnier micellar water which you can see i've used a lot of <laughs> i need to get a new one um but i use this after i cleanse just to make sure that if any makeup or dirt that's on my face from the day is like really gone you will actually be so surprised if you use this all the time how much dirt you can actually get off even if you were or weren't using makeup for the day it is a little bit insane why is the lighting is really bad today like my eyes look black it is a dull day so it's definitely always worth doing this and you can just see it's just brighten my skin already so the next product i'm going to be going in with after my micellar water is the algae leclera i think that's how you say it um this is their healthy glow glyconic toner and this i don't know why i never bought the pixie one before i don't think i knew much about it is it would change your life like currently they're sold out they don't sell it so it's like um i think they call it like a special buy so they haven't got any at the moment um of these because they literally sell out within a week but and it's literally i think they're like 3.99 this <laughs> is the most amazing thing because basically what it does i think it lightly exfoliates your skin so i tell you now if you have little spots or spots coming up if you use this after a day or two you will notice a difference in your skin like it is oh amazing even if i run out of this which because i use this daily i know i will i will still buy the pixie one because i've read loads of reviews and they're literally a dupe um because all the toners that they do for this are generally a a dupe for pixie um but this is the glyconic healthy glow one and you just need this in your life so if you're watching this i would definitely suggest getting the pixie one because obviously they don't currently have this um but if you do have this and you haven't really used it that much or you don't feel like honestly just start using it every single day and you will notice such a difference in your skin like this is for like guys and girls like this makes will make such a difference to you if you get little spots or just spots this 
is like the best thing and it's got aloe vera in it which i love it's like my favorite thing so what does it say on the back the healthy glow glyconic toner is specially formulated with five percent glycolic acid to help remove dead skin cells and instantly brighten refresh tone and remove excess oils after two weeks of using this product will help to leave pores looking more redefined skin surface extractors to help healthier look and look basically after two weeks you will notice a difference and it's just worth every penny like when they bring this back out i'm probably gonna buy like 10 just so i have it for a really long time i get tens of it of exaggeration probably like in a couple, but, but two more um but this is my must-have in this video without a doubt i'm probably gonna have a few but this is definitely my must-have anything that says like iconic acid in it that is what you need in your skin right care routine and i tell you now if you suffer with spots or anything or even if your skin's not that bad because my skin is generally not that bad like this will make such a difference to your life you will not even believe pop this on a pad if you're watching this and i am you're a dermatologist or some sort of skincare expert and i'm doing the circular motions on my face with this wrong let me know i'm more than happy to take the comment So after I've cleansed and toned my face, I'll be going in with my serum and I use two serums. I've recently started doing this just to get a little bit more hydration and get kind of like the results that I want. So the first one that I use is the Niacinamide 10% plus 1% Zinc. This is from The Ordinary Brand since i bought this this has just changed my life like i've noticed a difference within the first time of using it that my pores are looking a lot more minimized so with this i just grab a little bit and pop it just kind of where my pores are more enlarged because i wouldn't say i have massive pores um but this is just where my pores are and I feel like I know them or all I can actually tend to break out. So I just, I just look in in this area here. Really with this a long, a little goes a long way, but I always tend to put a bit too much on. So once that's kind of dried and mixed in a bit better, I'm gonna go in with another ordinary product. And this is the hyaluronic acid. 2% plus B5 and this helps with hydration and I'll pop just a little bit again so with this obviously you don't need to use both serums personally it's just I feel like I was just using the one to help with my pores and I just felt like my skin just didn't really have that like radiant hydration like tight look um it just helped my pores so with this like at least i'm getting a bit of both and i'm just getting it in the areas obviously that i need it the most once my um serum has sunk in i'm going to be using a moisturizer and the moisturizer i'm going to be using is the olay anti-wrinkle firm and lift night cream i have used this for years and i live by it it is like the best thing it actually it just does what it says and it firms your face and i you will notice a difference after probably a week i would definitely recommend this one so again a little bit goes a long way i mean you can probably already see from like the beginning of this video to like now how much more shiny I'm and I guess lighter my face is looking right now but again the lighting is dire right now because of the weather today but um okay next I'm gonna move on to eye creams um generally with your eye cream you can either do it before you've applied any um serums or anything all to your face or after you've done the serum and moisturizer i really think it's best probably to do it before serums um but i always tend to forget 
So I use in two to three different eye creams. And the first one that I use is the Olay Eye Deep Hydration Eye Gel. Um, Because I noticed my eyelids get quite dry, especially if I put a lot of makeup on and everything like that. Um, And I've also started developing um, like a little bit of eczema there. So I use this one um, on the tops of my lid to just really help hydrate. And I just get a little bit of product and just lightly mix it in. And so once I've mixed this in, once that's kind of dried, um, underneath my eyes here, I get dark circles. I mean, they're not the worst dark circles, but they're not the best. I just feel like concealer never works for me. Um, but what does actually really, really help, and I got this tip from a friend, um, is to use the Body Shop Vitamin C Glow Boost Moisturiser. So now I just use this when I feel like my when, when I feel like my eyes are really looking dark, need a bit of a pick me up under my eyes, and I tell you now, you will notice the difference the next morning. Like without a doubt, mix that in and then dab it. I don't know if you can see a difference now, um, but definitely the next morning you will notice a difference if you have dark under eyes. This will help lift them and hopefully cure them if you have really bad ones. So this is one of my highly recommended products in this video. So next I'm gonna talk about the products I use to help get rid of active spots that I currently might have. The one I really want to talk about, which is great for um, even just day use as well, is the Body Shop Tea Tree Targeting Gel. Um, this is suitable for blemish skin. So if you have any spot throughout the day or whatever, this will help just kind of minimise it and it should eventually really help get rid of it. Um, I tend to use this on the whiteheads as well because sometimes I feel like with even the cleanser it just doesn't work as quickly as I'd like to. So it's a great product. Um, personally a little bit expensive for the size but I've had this a while and it's lasted me a while so definitely highly recommend it. Another um, spot product that I use is um another mario one which is a drying lotion i've seen it if you know of the brand or anything like that and i think even like celebrities are said to have used this so this targets like every and any kind of spot you have i don't think it personally works on whiteheads i definitely would help but anything like a proper pimple or a spot that you have like that's really underneath the skin this will help with any spots that you have and all you need to do is, I don't know if you can see here, yeah, so you can see, you need to make sure that it's always flat, like this. So then this pink stuff here can sit at the bottom. You just grab this, pop it in like that, let's see if it's going in, and grab a little bit of the product at the bottom, take it out, and then just pop it on the areas that you need to. Currently, I don't really have any. This is just like a red mark from a spot I had. After I've done my serum and face creams, an eye cream sometimes not every day just because for my skin um it can make it break out it can be a bit too heavy um but i go in with an oil just to help with hydration um hugely or just to even just give you a bit of a boost and feel a bit of a luxury product maybe i would highly recommend the rose hip seed oil and this one i have is from revolution and this is the gold one I'm just going to add a little bit to show you guys, but I don't usually put this on and I don't feel like I need it right now. I'm just going to put the tiniest bit on just on my cheeks and my forehead. So I'm just going to drop, 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 see run down my face. And I'm just going to mix this in. I tend to not use this a lot because I do feel like it can help me break out and I just don't need that. <laughs> smells so nice once i put my oil on or if i'm not going to do an oil once i've done my moisturizer i will use one of these rollers i think they're just called a roller um and i got this one 
from Boohoo and it comes with this, which is also a similar thing to help tighten um, your skin. <laughs> I'm selling that one there. So with this, what I'll do is I'll just go over with my face. I have noticed it makes a really annoying noise. I think it's just because it's not the most expensive one. I'm not gonna lie, I've been using this for a little bit now. I don't use it every single night because it can be a lot of extra effort. Once I've used that, I will also use this, but you can just use one, you don't need to use both, but I tend to like to use both and I'll just use this under my eyes. Next, I'm going to talk about some of the hydrating sprays that I use. I don't use a hydrating spray every day. Um, I tend to use it just when I feel like I need a bit more of a wake me up. The one I've had the longest and I love and I kind of use it sometimes on like a hot day is the Body Shop Vitamin E Hydrating Face Mist. And this can also be used as a setting spray. One I would highly recommend that I have is the Boots Glow Brightening Mist. Skin looks hydrated and radiant. Another one is from Revolution. This is their CBD Nourishing Essential Spray. And this one smells like cucumbers, so it's quite nice. One I would also highly recommend for hydration is a one from Garnier, and this is the Rose Smoothing Glow Mist. Again, smells amazing. I use this also for the day if I feel like I need a little bit more of a pick-me-up. Next product I'm going to be talking about is what I use on my lips every night. And generally what I use throughout the day more recently is the Dr. Pore Pore Lip Balm. And this can also be used for hair, skin, cuticles, loads of different things. Using the Manga Laneige, okay. Another lip product that I use is from Laneige, which is their lip sleeping mask, and this one is in berry. So it's quite a thick texture. Don't know if you can notice, but what it is is you pop it on your lips with the little thing that they have Hold on like this. And you leave that on all night. So guys, that is it for my skincare routine. I hope you enjoyed the video and you will be purchasing some of these products because I live by them and have noticed such huge differences by using some of these products. Give it a thumbs up if you guys enjoyed. If you have any more questions about other products that I talked about or I briefly talked about in this video, just drop me a question below. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye. Ole and keep thank you <laughs> what is that a fun guy i'm using oh what a lovely day gloomy skin grumpily skin what the fuck is that about but it's this the oh shit how do you say this next